Hello everyone. Welcome. Let me flip you around a little bit better. Welcome to tonight's episode. Uh, Friday night. We're going to be doing um, some Walmart clearance shopping tonight. Uh, in this week's episode, I will be showing you uh, what Walmart deals are going down now um, for this week. Uh, I want to thank each and every one of you for tuning in. Um, I'm just going to wait a few minutes and see who we can get in the in the room. And we'll go from there. Let me uh, check the chat, see if I can get everything working now. Uh, let's see. Got two people in here now. Okay, uh, Melinda, have to work, sorry. Get the Walmart fuzzy blankets, they rock. All right, we'll have to check those out. Hello everyone, thanks for tuning in. We've got four people now. Um, I'm gonna give it a few more minutes. I'm a little early, I'm just trying to get settled in. Uh, we are here at Walmart. Uh, we'll be doing uh, the live tonight, discussing the uh, Walmart clearance deals that are happening for this week, as well as a Q&A. So if you guys have any questions, please drop them in the comments and I will try to answer them the best I can. Uh, once again, thanks for tuning in. We'll give it a few more minutes and let's see who we can get in. We got five people in here now. Um, I'm here at one of my favorite Walmarts. Uh, I really do like this store. It's rather large. A um, lot of good stuff. They keep their clearance aisles pretty stocked. Uh, let me just see what we got to work with tonight. Uh, ch -ch 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 -ch. Six people in here. Let's see if there's anybody chit-chatting in there now. Come on, guys. You guys got any questions? Whoop. Eugene. What's up, man? I believe I saw you got last time. Good to see you again. Thanks for tuning in. Oh, all right. A little cold out here. Hope you guys are having a good Friday night. Um, I appreciate you joining in. Uh, we just got a good snowstorm out, out this way. Um, snowstorm out this way uh where i'm at now we didn't get too much here but uh up on my way probably got about seven inches or so if you're if you're tuning in from texas i my heart goes out to you guys you guys are really struggling down there you got hammered uh what time we got 8 56 you know what let's walk inside we'll go ahead and get this thing started uh, i got my other phone with me got mask up grab a cart and we'll get started I'm flipping around so you guys can see so I want to welcome you guys to tonight's episode. We're going to be uh, checking out the Walmart clearance deals for this week. Uh, let's see, Eugene, tools, man. We will get to the tools. All right, so what we're going to be doing tonight is we will be starting off in personal care, um, hygiene. Uh, we've got a lot of stuff going on tonight. Let me see if I can sneak around this way. Uh, I will get to the chat here in a second. See who we have. Um, so tonight we are going to be talking about the deals for this week. This week we have uh, toothpaste, toothbrushes. Uh, um, what else do we have? We have we have um, shampoos. Uh, we've got some tools to go over for this week. Uh, let's check this Walmart clearance rack real quick. Let's get our other phone out. Let's check the chat real quick. We got four people in here tonight. 
Eugene the Tools, Clara, hello, welcome. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, who else we have? I'm sorry if I say your name wrong. Rosia, hello. Hopefully I said that said that right. I do apologize. Okay, so here, here is going to be one of them. A lot of oral bees are going on sale. Let's see what this one is. If I remember correctly. This one right here is probably about $169 originally. Let's get our app out and we'll scan. Let's see what we got tonight. All right, we're gonna need to change the store over, change it to where we're at. Well, this one's 119. So that's not one that's on sale. But trust me, this is what you want to look out for tonight. Ooh. There was one like this, guys. It's white with this brand. As low as five cents. Can you believe that? I know when I first saw it too, I was like crazy. But let's see what we got tonight. I want to thank you guys for tuning in. Hopefully I can provide some value to you. Oh, go ahead and smash that like button. Let's see how many likes we can get in here tonight. That one's full price too. They might be going back and uh, adjusting the price. Uh, it's something that happens from time to time. But it does happen. If I can get this one to scan. Let's see what we got. $40 mirror. Okay, I'm not going to take up too much time here. If you guys can find this one, though, right here. This is from Christmas time. This should have been marked heavily. Probably about $10. It says $40. Tag's relatively new. I'll get to the chat here in a second. So it is $40. $48 online. All right, this clan tile is junk, guys junk let's keep moving so where are we at uh razors it's not gonna be down this time. let's see let's see all right here we go here we go toothbrushes toothbrushes and toothpaste are on sale now keep your eye out be looking for clearance tags just like this one sometimes it will not be marked but you can see right here look at this Look at this Oral-B brush, $6, $189 before. That's crazy. With, it, with that being said, I will scan everything you see here. Scan it all. Let's see what we can find, guys. Smash the like button, you guys are getting value out of this. Let's see how many likes we can get on here. 79, come on. We're looking for the good stuff. We're not looking for a full price. There's another one, 64. 42. Clara, let's go back to the chat. Chelsea, how do you find so much clearance? My Walmart has nothing. It's just, I mean, it all depends on your, uh, your area. Chelsea, it all depends on your area. Um, some, some of the Walmarts where I actually live, not necessarily where I source, um, they're junk. They're weeks upon weeks upon weeks behind. Um, that's why I normally go out uh, quite a bit of distance. I'll travel, you know, an hour to go to a good store if they've got good stuff and I can hit up a few other stores between there. Um, I also use different sources. Uh, um, Brickseek, uh, other things like that. I've got several different methods. I, I try to find clearance. Um, but it also just means hitting the stores, checking each self, looking what's marking down. Been doing it for years, so it's kind of a rhythm for me. But yeah, Chelsea, that's how it's, that's how it's done. After Christmas, uh, my store resets toys and there's nothing. They have nothing in clearance right now. What? Clara, I'm sorry to hear that. 
once again, I'm hoping I'm saying your name right. Rosia, the white gleam. Yes, it is the white one. It's not the black one like I showed you earlier. Um, I'm not seeing the white one at all. This was definitely not one of the stores that had it for five cents, but it is out there. You can always check top stock as well. Uh, let's see, Cap Ant. My area Walmarts never have anything. The employees hide everything. I know, Cap Ant. It, it's a struggle, especially out in the rural areas. Um, it even happens in the city areas, the ones that I go to. Um, they'll work together as a team and, you know, they'll hold something. Let's see, they find the $6.40 toothbrush, but they know uh, Jimmy down the way, you know, really wants one. They'll hold it for him and wait and see. They're not supposed to. They can lose their job if they go hide clearance, um, and they know that. Clara, I got the brush for $10. Now it's full price, even though it is Christmas. It is Christmas, Clara. But good job for scoring for 10 bucks. Uh, Chelsea, I wonder if I go up where there is less population. Yes. Yes, yes, you probably will have better luck, Chelsea. I mean, yes and no. If you go to where it's heavily populated, they're more likely to start clearing out more items a lot heavier than it would be out in the rural areas. Like today, I scored, um, no, it was last night, I scored a $45 deer feeder um it was 174 that store that i scored it from is three or four weeks behind when i actually scored three more before that for the same price it just all depends on the stores that you're going to so yeah all right i think we're good caught up on the chat should we scan a little bit more here we've got something here 80 dollars. but look look at the tag let me show you this you see this right here Wait for it to zoom in. 5820. That's when this tag was made. Yeah, the box is broken, but if you're gonna use it for yourself, why not grab it? Let's scan it and see what we have. Um let's see. Come on. So it's seventy dollars, it's off. If you guys don't know what the tag says or understand what it means and, and the shelf is empty, just do this. If I can get the dang thing to zoom in and scan. So much glare on this aisle. Let's try it again. There we go. So I don't know what that looks like. This will show me. So it's an 8000 series. Genius. So you can look around and look around and see if you can find any 8000 series genius. Uh, this twin pack over here. This is uh, something that's caught my eye from just from a quick glance. But that 8000 series, I'm not seeing it here. And at that price, who would, right? So that one's that one's not good. Let's try the twin pack. I don't want to spend too much time on this because I want to give you a bunch, as much value as I can. So the two pack is regular. All right, but you got, you've got, uh, you've got other items you can look at. It doesn't have to just be these ones down here. So toothpaste. Let's move on. Toothpaste. Um, to be honest, it was early on this week like very early on like sunday i know that's not this week but that was the earliest um let's see if i can show you some really recent items shampoos and soaps were very recent but it's been a while i know i say very recent and then i go and tell you it's been a while um let me see if I can find this one shampoo. It's actually a conditioner. But apparently, it is very good from what my wife says. It's expensive. Can't believe this one shampoo is like $29. Oh, where is it at? 
where is it? I'm trying to think of what the name of it is. It's, I think it's like, I'm just not seeing it here. It, it might actually be in its own aisle. Let me look it up really quick while I have you on here. Um, and we can check it together. So let's see. I'll check the chat here in a second. Once again, smash the like button, guys. Let YouTube know, hey, this guy at least produces somewhat of a good video. I'm, I'm hoping I'm giving you a bunch of value. We'll get to it, don't worry. Now, my last live was my very first live and it was quite quite long at an hour and 30 minutes I'll try to keep it at an hour or under an hour um, just bear with me for one second I'm trying to pull up my shopping list to get the name of that one so bio lodge it is on sale for nine dollars now bio lodge that's what I thought it was. I just didn't want to say the wrong name. Let me go check the chat real quick. We'll come back up. Uh, let's see. In Seattle. Chelsea. In Seattle, there isn't Walmart, so everyone travels out of the city, and those Walmarts are hard or hit hard. Yeah, Chelsea, it all depends if you've got other other people that are out clearing something just like you are. Um, Melinda, what are you looking for? Melinda, we are covering... This week's, um, this week's clearance items, we're going to be uh, covering toothbrushes, um, hunting items are on fire right now, the rugs are on fire right now. Um, this might not be the store to find it at, but I, this, is, this is the closest store that you know has the best clearance overall. That's why I chose this one for you guys for tonight. There's a few other... There's a, um, a ladder that I want to be able to show you, hopefully. It's marked down to $21. Uh, let's see. Chelsea, salon shampoos, high priced, are norm normally in a different section. Yes, they are, Chelsea. That's why I was having a difficult time. We'll move over. Um, it might actually be right behind me. Uh, here it is. Bio Lodge. So here it is, it's conditioner. So let's see what we have. Let's see. It's going to be, it's going to be purple. I think it's gonna be this one right here. Let's scan it. Get the Walmart out app. this thing to zoom in and let's see yep here it is nine dollars online 1678 it says 1760 on the shelf I'm just gonna grab one for my wife um, but definitely show you guys that see that's hidden clearance right there I like when I find hidden clearance it means that I can beat beat the other people to it there's only two of them um, maybe I'll grab the other one. You can always return it. Well, this is shampoo. Let's, whoop, hopefully I didn't break the bottle. Let's see if the shampoo's running. If the shampoo's nine, then that'll be great too, right? Check the chat here in a second, guys. Bear with me. So, no, it's not. Shampoo's 1760. So it's just a conditioner for right now. 17 people in here. What's up guys? I'm glad you guys can make it. Uh, started a little bit earlier, but hopefully as we filtered filtered you guys in and we're definitely gonna pump out some good content tonight. I've only gotten a couple hours in. This store is huge. Nine likes guys, let's see if we can raise that up. Uh, Clara, back to the uh, chat. Clara, I went two hours for LOL dolls and houses shown in stock, but when I got there, nothing. Clara, did you check? everywhere um did you check lawn and garden did you look on top stock top stock is way up here 
not necessarily in this aisle, but top stock. Um, did you have them scan the barcode? Did you give them the UPC? There's just so many variables. Um, let's move on. Chelsea, uh, Clara, I feel for you that was the worst. I know. All right. Clara, you're doing a great job. Appreciate it, Clara. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Melinda, that's the cheap aisle. Yeah, they're usually an upper price product sh or produce shelf. Um, not sure by that, Melinda. But yeah, I was able to find it. It was right there for that shampoo. Or um, get out of this way. Just do me way. We'll keep moving on. Um, let's see. Uh, Omar, check basketball hoops. Found one for 50 bucks. Sells for 170. Yeah. For fifty dollars, that's a good deal, dude. Good deal, Omar. Um, let's see. I did actually find it wasn't at this store, but the uh, basketball hoops were. I found one that was fifty dollars, down from three hundred and ninety-eight. I know that was insane. I should have got it, but it's just such a big box. Uh, let's see. Chelsea, is it worth paying for Brickseek or do you use just the basic free info? Chelsea, you can use just the free as long as you can get the UPC, which is on any product that you find. It's just the barcode number. It's a universal product code. Uh, it's on every single product. If it's not on the product that you're looking at, you don't want to buy it. Uh, but yes, for the free version, you can definitely use it. We got quite a few people in here. Let me wait for them to clear out and we'll keep going. But yeah, for the free version, you can definitely use that. Oh, excuse me. What do we got down here? Some scrunchies. Uh, uh. Yeah, you can definitely use the free version. Um, the pro version, uh, which is next. I mean, that one, it, I would say if you're an avid hunter, that would be the next version to get in $9.99. And then you have the big version, the extreme version, which is $29.99. That's for people that are willing to go out and do long distances and, you know, clear the shelf of everything that they have. If you're a reseller, that would be great. You can also be a reseller at any of those versions. The free one, for sure. It's just going to take more time to find stuff. So, let's see. Uh, where are we at? Chelsea, we already got to you. I'm still hoping I'm saying your name right. Rosia. Suave shampoo and conditioner 12-pack on sale. Or twin pack, not twelve pack. Yes, it is. It should be a dollar fifty or two fifty. Uh, Clara, yes, sir. Everywhere asked employees. They told me the store count was wrong. This possible? If you're st all right, so the store count could definitely be wrong, especially now. Um, you're getting towards the end of their their year on when they they send everybody out. They send a big team out to do a full store reset. That's where they go through and they count every single thing and make sure that the counts for each product are correct or incorrect. They'll delete items, they'll add items. That's what you want. After that's come along and happened, that's when you're going to have correct inventory, hopefully. Okay? Got 20 people here, 10 likes. Guys, great to see you. I appreciate each and every one of you tuning in. Hopefully you guys are getting value out of this. We're gonna keep moving on. I'm just trying to answer everybody's comments. Um, Melinda product, Chelsea, you're welcome. Uh, Omar, get it next time. I sold it in less than four hours and live in a small area. Yes, Omar, I would have bought in the mall, but I can't fit a big old basketball hoop in my car. I didn't have my uh, SUV or truck at that time. So I would definitely, Definitely should have got them. Uh, DA Golden Ghost, can you look for Fortnite clearance? I haven't seen any, 
but I can surely look. We'll run down the toy clearance aisle. It's a big aisle in this store. Uh, we'll just take a quick glance. All right, I think I'm caught up. 22 people in here. Glad you guys could make it. Smash the like button. Subscribe to the channel for more awesome videos just like this one, guys. Let's see. Um, so we're over here. Got some good clearance going. Now this tag is super old. 1030 of last year. I don't know. Could it be cheaper? Could it not be? You've got some good old spice. Um, body wash for 335. If the tag, if the date on the tag is relatively new, I wouldn't worry about scanning it. You're just gonna waste your time. I mean, it, there's a possibility that it could be different, but it's just a way that you can just quickly go through the store. But if you find something, so like it's cheaper online. You can always price match to online, guys. Uh, let's see what we have here. Toothpaste. So that toothpaste is relatively new. What else do we have? Just not seeing anything else. Got one more clearance aisle over here. Okay, little kids brushes, which is good. This is half price. If you ever just needed one, you're just coming in to find it or just coming in to grab something real quick. It's worth a try. Now this one right here is Firefly 690, 219. I mean, it, I think it's, I think it's, it is 219, but I've seen them pretty low. Let's scan it and we'll move on. We'll get out of this uh, aisle. Um, candles are on fire right now. I don't know if I told you. Rugs. Yeah, it's still 690. All right, so let's move on out of this aisle. We're going to keep moving, guys. 18 people here. Glad you guys can make it on a Friday night. Um... I don't know if I did this too late or if this is too early of a live. Um, I try to accommodate everybody's time zone. Look what we have here. Dollar. Hemp seed oil. This is like some fancy deodorant. Sensitive skin. For a dollar though, I'm going to take all of them. If I can not break them as I put them in my cart. All of the ones that are not broken. See this one's broken right here. We got other stuff up here. Olay stuff for a dollar. Wow. Check that out. Detoxifying body mask. It's another one. I don't know anything about it, but for a dollar. If you can't buy it at the dollar store, you can buy it here. There's pure poor I don't know. Some stuff for your for your face. White tea. Pantene, head and shoulders, lots of makeup. Looks like this makeup is actually a dollar. But could be something else. Let me get this last deodorant and we'll move on. Sometimes they'll throw just carts like that out in the main aisle because they're just trying to entice the people to get rid of it. Let me go over here um, and see what candles we can find tonight. Uh, we're looking for Yankee candles as well as some other, um, I think it's called Woodwick. It's not going to be stuff like that because this is a brand new aisle that they just put together. If you can find Valentine's stuff, guys, right now is 90% stock up for next year. You can still use the items throughout the year as well. Candy, stuff like that. So here's a clearance aisle we're coming up on. It's all marked. What about this thing right here? Foodie never, never stick. Let's see, where is the, if I can find the UPC without knocking the whole shelf over. Let's scan this foodie thing up top. Let's see what we can find and then we'll go from there. So 149 online, it's 109. Not too bad. All right, so these aroma things. These are nice. Aroma diffusers. Look, guys, five bucks. Was through thirty-three dollars and fifty cents. Those are really nice. I guess you just pour your diffuser in. Seventy-five cents for those. Wow. Good deal. I'm not into that aroma mist stuff, but 
if you know somebody or just turn around and resell it who cares right that one's pretty nice as well how much is this one it says 24 i st actually scanned that at another store but that doesn't mean that it's this one look look at this 25 cents 467 so check your candle aisle please please check your candle aisle um no there's no candles up there we need to go this way let me check the chat real quick and see what's popping um that's a good spot to pull over let's check the chat uh let's see dawn do you ever find furniture on hidden clearance uh very few but far and few between dawn um if i do find the furniture it's been brought to my attention it could be on hidden clearance the tag just could not have a clearance item or a clearance tag on it but i know that it's on clearance from doing research but let's see conrad what are you looking to score in the hunting section conrad hunting um sections on fire right now i got a bunch a bunch of deer feeders uh i think that um the corn's on sale as well as just a bunch of hunting accessories uh last night i was able to go to one that had um a bunch of mossy oak uh um mossy oak clothing uh pants um shirts jackets all of that let's see where we're at right here uh let's see I'm not sure where the oh here we go came to while all right, so we're in the candle aisle. Let's see what we can find. I'm gonna try to find some good stuff for you here. Um, although, it's pretty bare. Let's see. Let's see, let's see. I'm looking for off. I'm looking for off um, fragrances that are going to be older from Christmas time or so. Wood fire apple. That might be something. Now these ones, if you find them, if you find the Yankees, those are gonna be $1.50 at the the least that I've seen. And then these ones, be like 10 cents or 50 cents. They're originally like three bucks, 3.30. Let's see what we got. Full price, yeah. Full price, full price. Um, let's see if we can scoot over here. You're fine. Sparkling cinnamon, humidor. So you don't want to find any of the boat looking ones. Uh, kitchen spice, backberry. You would think balsam and cedar are it, but it's not. Let's see. She has that spot next to her desk, too. Yeah. Oh, lordy. Fireside. All right, no, I'm not seeing any. They might have moved all the candles over to where we were before. Um, but yeah, those big ones. Yankee candles, $1.50. The other ones, 10 cents to 50 cents. Let's check the rugs while we're here. Not this aisle. You guys are getting value out of this content. Smash the like button, please. Subscribe to the channel. All right, so let me tell you what I look for when I'm first in here. Okay, we got 21 people in here, 15 likes. Let's see. Uh, let me check the comments real quick before I tell you what I look for in this aisle. Don, I scored a trail camera for 25 the other week. Yes, Don. Good job. There was actually a trail camera that is supposedly um, cellular uh, that's been marked down to 25, was 98. Um, I didn't score any. I didn't need any, so I didn't go hunting for them. Uh, Chelsea, sometimes I scan stuff and it doesn't even recognize the product. What's up with that? Um, I wish I had a product I could scan for you, Chelsea. I think I know what you're talking about. It's going to show like a little alien spaceship type thing it says something went wrong keep scanning it um if you still can't locate it just go to the tree the tree would be 
I don't know if they have any in here. The, what I call the tree is the scanner that's on the wall. And you can try to get it scanned there. Um, so yeah, just taking an eye on her and just seeing what she's doing. Let's see. Claire, the candles in the hunting section are my store. I've already been sold out. Yeah, you got to be quick with it. If you guys subscribe to this channel, I try to put out the videos as soon as I can. I'm even quicker on my Instagram page. I post pictures, pricing, they give you the most up-to-date, as fast as I can let you guys know about it. Uh, let's see, J-Rex, that trail cam has been gone from my Walmart for a while now. Yeah, J-Rex, man. It's, um, it all depends on your store. Some, some stores are a lot quicker than others. Uh, I wish I lived in Texas. Not right now, of course, but Texas, there's so many Walmarts there, and they are way, weeks, weeks, weeks before the area that I'm in now. So, yeah, I think I'm caught up on the uh, comments. 24 people in here, 15 likes. Thanks, you guys. I appreciate each and every one of you guys for joining in. I'm hoping I'm giving you as much value as possible. Um, I'm going to look at my, uh, my sheet here in a second um, just to double check on these lower rugs. Where are we at? These lower rugs in here to make sure that I'm not missing any. But what I like to do for the main rugs is I'll find rugs like this. You see how they're all one color, one product. So I'll keep going down, I'll keep going down, and I'll find ones that are kind of off. Like this one right here. This one right here. It's not in the same row as these two. So I'm like, hmm. Why is this like this? Maybe I should scan it. I did find a rug similar to this one earlier today. Actually, that was last night. I don't believe it was this exact one. I'm going to scan it just to make sure. But yeah, that's what I want you guys to do. Walk through the aisle and find stuff that's out of the ordinary. If I can get this, uh, this phone camera to work. This phone has really been acting up on me. I need to upgrade. So no, that one's still full price. Let's keep on moving down the line. See what we can find. All these shag rugs look the same. Uh, let's see, let's see. I actually didn't see any rugs on clearance. Um, before I came here, I did my research to make sure that I could to at least try to find a one or two rugs for you but this walmart actually carries the big rugs i'd love to find the eight by tens those are nice uh, let's see let's see if anything's hiding back here no oh you got this one right here what's going on with this one let's scan this one Come on. I need you to work, camera. You're not helping any of us. I need you. They need you. 1888. I mean, it's a, what, a 4 by or is that a 4 by 5 Something like that. Um, yeah, I'm just not seeing any guys right through here, unfortunately. Uh, let's see. If you bear with me for one minute, I'm just going to check um, my site and see if I can find any rugs, whether they be little or big. I hope uh, you guys are having a great night tonight, Friday. Um, I appreciate you guys for tuning in. I know that everybody's schedule is hectic. And I'm glad you guys are here learning what this past week's markdowns have been. If you're new here, my name's Drew, AKA Hunter of the Clearance. I try to find all clearance deals and bring them straight to you as quickly as I can. From all different retailers, Walmart is my favorite, uh, Target, Lowe's, Home Depot, um, Ross from time to time. Uh, subscribe so you guys stay in the loop and up to date, smash that bell notification. 
uh, and definitely definitely stay tuned for more great finds um, I'm gonna try to bring you as much value tonight as possible I am just taking a look just bear with me right now I'm taking a look to see to see what uh, rugs they have if any uh, let's see let's see lots of candles uh, there's a brown rug for seven do I see it though uh, I don't think it's that one but we can scan it really quick just to verify so I've got something that looks similar to this shag one that's supposedly on clearance right now and it is not this one but look at the price difference guys you really wanted that rug that's a $30 savings right actually almost $40 sitting at $30 $30 savings right off the bat just price check it price match it at the register just walk through here see if I can see that one that I just located I'm not seeing it okay yeah you win some you lose some uh, let's keep moving I don't want to tie you guys up too much in one spot I want you guys at least stick around so I can show you as much as possible but just a recap of where we've been uh, we first started over in the toothpaste and toothbrush aisle a lot of that stuff's clearancing out right now please check it out check for yellow tags then we went straight over to the candles and now we're in the rug area all these areas that I'm showing you are this week's deals uh, there will always be new deals week after week and I will be able to bring alive to you each and every week to let you know what we can find okay what's out there um, there is some there are some little rugs I hate to leave them because they were like a dollar but I'm just not not seeing them in my thing I saw them earlier let me make sure I'm at the right place yeah in the right store just checking just bear with me for one second guys I'm just checking through my list I apologize for that I'm getting messages left and right tonight Didn't they not get the memo I'm doing a live? I need to focus on my community and let them know what's going on. Oh, geez Louise. All right. Um, we're going to move on, guys. I don't want to be here too late. Let me go to the comments really quick and see what's going on. Okay, uh, let's see. Where are we at? J-Rex, I got to you. Clara. What about the dolls that were supposed to be 50 cents? I had scanned them and they said 50 cents, but at the register, it's full price. Why? Um, Clara, where, where did you scan them? Did you scan them on the Walmart app? Did you scan them on the tree? The the um, the scanner that's on the wall, on that uh, pillar? Uh, where, 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 where did you scan them from? Uh, Chelsea, that happened to me with Dollar Shave Club and they wouldn't honor it. Um, so if you guys scan something in the app, and let's just say it's a dollar on the app, but it comes up as five dollars at the register. If you have just one, you can be really nice and say, hey, um, do you think that you can honor this for me? I'm, it's not like I'm taking a bunch of them. I just got one. Um, I normally don't look at shelf tags when I shop. I just scan with my app. Um, you can come up with different excuses. It's not necessarily an excuse. It's different tactics that you can use to kind of weasel your way around i don't know that sounds awful bad too but but that's that's just another way to try to get them to honor it um clara scanning had been very bad lately it, it all depends clara i did find seven of the two dollar roasting pants today wow good job clara seven uh seven of the two dollar roasting pants you got a lot of roasting to do way to go 
Chelsea, TJ Maxx has a bunch of clearance. I got a bunch of cleaning supplies for super cheap. That's good. Good job, Chelsea. Yeah, TJ Maxx. I think TJ Maxx and Home Goods are now one. Uh, they've in my at least in the areas that I shop, they're they're one store, which is a kind of a two shop a two two shop stop. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna be hitting hitting the uh, the resale market here pretty hard soon, so I should be making some videos for TJ Maxx, Marshalls. Uh, homes goods stuff like that. Um, so please stay tuned for those Let's see uh, Clara I missed part of this. Have you been to the baby section yet? No Clara um, It wasn't this week. I don't even think it was last week, but um, The week before that I hit one store and I scored big time from bassinets to um what are those? I, I guess they're called like rockers and stuff like that. Um, but I got car seats. You can check all that stuff out on my Instagram page. But it'd be kind of far back because I post quite a few things daily. But you can scroll back and get UPCs for them and all that other jazz. Uh, let's see. Bobby, I found a Campbell Impact Wrench for $1.65. Normally $80. Wow, Bobby. That's a money, money deal right there. Good job, dude. Hopefully you hopefully you found more than one. I would have bought all of them. Sold those for like half of eighty dollars, forty bucks all day long. Um, that's a great find, dude. Great find. Okay, bless me. What website do you use to look for clearance items? Okay, um, number one is uh, I focus on Brixie. Uh, I've got the most extreme membership. It's pretty pricey, but the way I go through items, it's definitely very valuable. Number two is the Walmart app. What you can do is, a little trick is what I like to do is go into the Walmart app, go to the walmart.com, go to my stores, click the store that's closest to you. You can change them out. Um, let, me, let me show you really quick. I'll show you on the other show you my other phone so you go into the walmart app and up here at the top in the search results you're going to type in something that you're looking for okay so we'll just type in lego and you see how it says lego up there and it says in my department all right so you'll let that load you'll go over to my store and you can always change through different stores but look this is what i want you to do go through here and this is how i find clearance look You'd never know that was a dollar unless it was on the shelf marked a dollar. This is another Lego set for 25. And you can do this with anything. You can do this with the rugs. So rugs. This was another way. So we can go in through here and we can try to find items that are on clearance. Like look, there's a rug right there for two bucks. Then we take our visual and we go down the aisle and we look for that. Yes, this takes a lot of time. You have to be very dedicated. You have to have a lot of patience. 80% of the time you're going to fail, but don't let it get to you, okay? Um, but yeah, just just do that. So you just keep looking. You scroll all the way down, all the way down, until it, it won't feed you any more uh, results. You'll find, look, a dollar. I mean, you can do this for anything, okay? So that's that, guys. 29 people in here. Thank you guys for tuning in. Coming up on 50 minutes. Man, this just flies by. 20 likes. Let's see if we can get up to 30 likes by um, the hour mark, okay? That'd be awesome. Smash that like button, guys. Let's see. Uh, Bobby, in an 8-gallon air compressor from 145 to 37. Bobby, I hope you took the time. Let's see. Uh, you were in Wisconsin. I hope you took the time to scan almost everything in that aisle. Because that would have been crazy. With the deals that are going on that you're telling me. I would have been walking out there with cartfuls. Um, Eugene, yes, Eugene. You and Bobby need to hook up, man. It sounds like he's got the tools covered. Uh, let's see. Brad, $2.50, $3 tumblers and sporting goods. Yes, uh, tumblers are on sale right now. Frontier Flipper, self-checkout for everything. I don't do cashiers when getting clearance. This is correct, Frontier Flipper. Uh, self-checkout for everything. 
and even then um, yes yeah, self checkout for everything sometimes when I get up there like with the three cent games that I got recently you know your heart beats a little bit because you're like is it gonna say error uh, is it gonna say I can't sell the item is it gonna say set item aside for cashier please I've had all of those things happen to me it's just a gamble but self checkout is going to be your best bet um, if you're afraid that you're that the price is not going to be the same or if you think that you're stealing because the price is different than what it says on the shelf which you're not because that's just how the clearance works here at Walmart there's just so many variables if you don't feel comfortable self checkout is the way to go thank you frontier flipper for that Clear a three in one step and ride line, big box in the baby section. Regular $39.74. I got it for $15. Good job. Let's see, what is that? A three in one step and ride lion, big box. Uh, I'm not sure what that looks like. I've got a youngin, so I'm familiar with the baby section. Bobby, thanks. Only found one. I'm not a reseller, but thinking I should start. Bobby, I mean, you don't have to be a reseller. Especially nowadays, if you've you know lost your job or you just need some extra money coming in or um, you just want some, I mean, if you just want to just make it, make it something fun. I I love shopping. I love clearance shopping. It's what I've done from the time I was little. I used to go out to yard sales and garage sales and flea markets and all that stuff so it's in my blood um but yeah anybody can do it, it it's just it, it's just so much fun all right brad coleman folding chairs and sporting goods regular 40 for 15 big comfy chairs yes nice good job brad eugene hit that sporting goods in a while all right man let me go over there right now. I'm going to do this for Eugene because Eugene was here with me last time. Whoa, 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 whoa. 16 ounce absorb skate. What is that? And why do I have a bunch of little aisles? Just give me one second. Let's see what we got here. See these clearance tags, man. They hunt me out. Sniff them out like a bloodhound. 34 people in here. Good to see you guys. You're jo just now joining. My name is Drew, aka Hunter of the Clearance. 10 cents. Uh, yep, I can't see what the picture is. Um, I'm out here to find all clearance deals and bring them straight to you guys. Um, as fast as they come out, I like to bring them straight to you so you guys can't miss a beat. You don't miss a step. Uh, I could be here for a little while, but um, Eugene was asking about the tool section, so we're going to head over there. Uh, he was on my last live and I wasn't able to make it there. We're coming up on the hour mark. Smash the like button, guys. Let's see what we can find for Eugene. Uh, tools, tools, tools. Uh, where is the tool section? Man, people are just hitting me up like crazy. We're over here playing football in here. Y'all can't play football in this store. All right. Eugene, let's see what we can find for Eugene. All right, so we've got this is a rollback. It's kind of like it's on sale. Don't leave these tags because these tags usually end up being clearance. Let's see if it's changed. Eugene, I hope you're paying attention. We're going to this out for you pretty hard. So that is even wrong. It says it's $7.24, but the tag says $5. So I would challenge that, take a picture, bring it up to the front. There's no tools on this aisle. Let's keep going for Eugene. How are you tonight? Good, good, good. Let's see what we got. We got locks and doorknobs, not in the right aisle. They got the tool aisle all the way in the back over here. Okay, I sent my brother-in-law out earlier on a little mission for, let's see if I can find it here. It's not the drill bits. Um, 
It was more like a socket set. But what you can do is always just scan stuff like this because all this stuff could have been from Christmas time. Um, and it, none of it has a price except for the very top, which says 15. There's no way that all of these are $15. I can get this dang thing to scan. Six bucks, see? There's no way that's 15. There's no way any of this is 15. So six bucks for that. It doesn't tell me what it was before, but that's not a bad price to have in your car. Or to give away for a gift. Let's see what this five plier set is. Uh, let's see. Come on. Let's see what we got. Let's see if we can find something. But yeah, I sent a brother and that's eleven ninety seven, so that's not on sale. I sent my brother in law out for a dollar socket sets this morning. He was able to find six of them. It said six in stock. Let's see. Ten ninety seven. Uh, 1097. There's a socket set. Let's see what this socket set is. This is not the one, but I wish I had Bobby's dollar fifty uh fifty something uh impact wrench. That would be nice. 1198. So we're hitting full price. If it's got an 88 and stuff like that. It's usually full price. I did notice a pressure washer that was marked down to 45. It's not at this store. It's 145 at this store, but it's as low as $45. Uh, let's see. What else can we find tonight, Eugene? What else can we find? It's kind of hard with with um, with tools for clearance, um, unless it's definitely marked. It's hard to find it. I would say with tools, if you have the time, scan all this stuff up here. All this stuff up here. Um, it's, it, you, you might have better luck finding clearance up there. What do we have right here? See this? What is this? And also, if you see something on top stock that's not on the bottom stock, scan it. Let's see what this is. Let's scan it. Let's scan it. What do we got? So these are eight bucks. Nice. It's not too bad. So you get four, four individual uh, cases. You got drill bits, regular bits, more drill bits. They're probably wood and metal. That's not too shabby probably sell that for 15 20 bucks online on the marketplace anywhere have a yard sale uh, Eugene hopefully you are getting some value out of this man spread the word uh, what's this right here you see this right here stuck in between there was actually a combo set I'm just scanning it real quick Let's see what this is. 109, 148, 109. I've seen this combo set a lot lower, a lot lower. Uh, you could try seeing this with a 10, 20, 7, 20 tag on it. Very old tag. Fifty-eight bucks. So yeah not too shabby on the clearance aisle could be better but eugene wanted to take a look through here let me take a look in the chats real quick and see hold on no that's not it is this the same thing four tool combo kit right there four tool, four tool combo kit let's see if I can get the uh, camera on my phone to work. Getting ready to throw this phone to the curb. But when you find a $350 phone for 25 bucks, you keep it, right? 
I've dealt with phones in the past, guys, and they're just a pain in the butt, especially if you're trying to resell a prepaid phone. Uh, let me take a look at the chats real quick. See what we can find. All right, where are we at? Let's see. Do, 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 do. All right, Eugene. Yep, you're welcome, buddy. Frontier Flipper. Yes, you can. I used to play hide and seek in Walmart with friends. Walmart, shenan <laughs> Walmart shenanigans are the best. Yeah, man. You know, never grow up. Keep that dinosaur alive, right? Is that what they say in uh, uh, Step Brothers? Don't lose your dinosaur. All right. Scan anything art. Uh, heart. James says, scan anything heart. I've been racking up lately. Well, James, there's a lot of heart going on. But yes, um, if I wanted to spend four hours on this live with you guys, I'd be scanning a lot more. But I'm trying to just bust through it. Uh, but we can work together as a community, as a team, and, and kind of feed off each other and, and help each other out. Uh, give each other ideas. Um, show each other deals that we find. I'm going to be building a face group, uh, Facebook group soon so we can comment and share in there. All right, let's see. Brad, old but still tons available at most Wally's. Keep clean. 12-inch hand sanitizer for five cents. Yeah, I saw a lot of those, especially on social media. Um, that's another place you guys can look. Check out Instagram Walmart clearance um, or the store that you're looking for, Target clearance, Ross clearance. Lowe's clearance and a lot of people will help you out and get visuals, UPCs, stuff like that. Clara, uh, I got the five fifty piece. I got the five dollar fifty piece drill set. That's not bad, Clara. Not bad a price at all. Eugene, Sam James, Hart has massive steals. Yes. Now Hart is as Walmart's new new tools. It used to be hyper tough. They're probably going to be getting rid of hyper tough. Um, so to replace heart, I'm not a fan of, of either one, but if the price is right, I will definitely go for it. Uh, let's see, way to go, James. Send the rest of us some luck, please. Yes, Clara. Screw, screwdriver set up top. Brad says screwdriver set up top. <sighs> we got a couple, Brad. But those are down on the bottom, so I wouldn't have to scan too, I wouldn't have to go grabbing them. Uh, six inch bar clamp you could always check in these boxes right here for uh, for items you might even find a three cent item if an item hits three cents guys it should be pulled from the shelf from the employees um, it shouldn't be sold but you can get away with it please go to self checkout good luck on that if you want more just DM me on Instagram I'll try to um, Help you out. Uh, let's see, screwdriver set. James says 50 bit set. Scan the heart screwdriver sets. Two dollar, two piece flyer sets, etc. There you go, James. He's giving us some good ideas to scan. Clara, someone get that drill set for three dollars. Uh, quarter inch and three eighths inch socket sets, ten dollars and sixteen. Just trying to help. Also twenty. That's fine, James. You guys. I'm trying to build this community, this YouTube community, so we can all share each other's successes and finds and really bring out um, the best clearance for everyone. So share away, please. Jump on Walmart's Wi-Fi, uh, should scan better for you. Big 292, yeah. Uh, um, this other phone, I'm actually, that's all I can really get on this phone is Wi-Fi. It, it's a... Um, it's a Sprint phone. I don't have Sprint service, so I can't use it, but I use it for anything Wi-Fi. I use it just for my scanning. I use it for filming my videos when I'm not doing lives. But for 25 bucks for a two, three, four hundred dollar phone, can't beat it. Uh, Clara, I'm a clearance junkie. I get so giddy when I find a good, yeah, Clara, it's fun. It really is. Smash the like button, yep. Eugene, I appreciate it. Yes, smash the like button. Let's see if we can get 40 likes before a minute and 10 seconds in. We got 35 people here. I appreciate each and every one of you guys. If you're just now tuning in, my name's Drew, aka Hunter of the Clearance. 
I'm here to bring all clearance deals straight to you as soon as I can find them. So I can let you guys know the best pricing, the best places to find it uh, from all different retailers. So we're gonna hop out of the um, tool aisle. Just went there for Eugene real quick. Uh, wow, I've got some totes over here for six bucks. Those aren't bad. Let's see, what is the thing? Two thirds, so it's a couple days old. I don't see it changing. Um, but yeah, we've got uh, two weeks ago, bikes were, the bike section is still, was definitely on fire. It might still be on fire. You got a few helmets in here. What is this thing? Razor glitter pink. That's not. Um, I'm just gonna scan this because we're passing right by it. So I mean, you've got. It's not so much whoever was talking to me about the Wi-Fi. It's it's the fact that this camera is is horrible when it comes to focusing. Um, it just takes forever, and I just it just. It bugs me sometimes, especially when I'm trying to give it out to you guys. Oh wow, five bucks. Was thirty dollars? Five bucks. Let's look for this helmet real quick. So that's what we're looking for. Do 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 do. Uh, not seeing it. And at that price, you probably won't see it because it's probably gone. You can see a lot of a lot of tags are still nine dollars. Um, SS Tricky helmet, ten bucks. Come on, man! If I can get ever get it to zoom in, so it is ten bucks. But yeah, you can just scan items just like this, guys. Just take the time, scan the tag, see what it is. Five bucks for the Black Bell Connect helmet. Black Bell. I think they're actually getting rid of Bell because you see Zephyl a lot, which is this right here. Um, and Bell was a lot of the items, bike pumps down there, um, seat covers, uh, tubes for right here. Uh, so I would say anything bell you might want to scan We got a few bells down here in the bottom. I'm just looking for that one helmet really quick uh, Which I'm not seeing So let's just let's take a look. I don't need to take it off the shelf the, the tag is exactly what it says it is bell axle mint helmet Come on Thirty-six people in here. Thirty-one likes. Smash that like button, guys. I can't get it to scan, but you guys can. You guys see the picture. Uh, what do we have? Crayola chalk. No, 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 no. Okay. If you're new here and you don't understand what this tag is, this is another clearance tag, but this tag is strictly for this item. This item will never change. What they do is they put a um, barcode over top of the UPC code. You can see it right there. If they have this, it will be uh, like a um, a Sharpie. They'll just mark right up through the middle and you won't be able to scan it. If you are able to scan it, see look, they didn't put one on this UPC. So let me show you. So the tag says 1874. Uh, see if I can get these this thing to act correctly see what you get you get a full priced item so it will never work for you if it does and you get lucky and it's less then scoop it up but another thing is is when you get an item like this that has this stack this is a return item I'd say 80 to 90% of the time when you have this, it's a return item or it's broken. It's an item that they're trying to get money for that's usually junk and I don't, I don't want you to buy it unless you've really inspected it and gone over it. So let's move on. You've got $9 bike pumps. Um, 
Mark down from 24. This tag is kind of old. Let's scan it. If I can get the thing to zoom in. Really causing me problems tonight. Coming up on an hour and 10 minutes. Jeez Louise. Appreciate you guys for staying tuned. Sticking around. I can't scan it. Um, I don't need any more bike parts. My brother-in-law doesn't need any more bike parts. Spent over $700 on bike stuff. We're just waiting for... Um, waiting for a good time to resell them. So look. Still says clearance for the bike thing. Or for the basketball hoop. So I know someone was saying basketball hoop before. Let's see what they are. So in here it's 79 for the 46 inch. Online it's 174. 79 so you could say a hundred dollar savings what do we have we can scan this one I'm not gonna be able to scan that one because it's all beat up we can scan this one down here so online this one's 98 and it's 48 in the store we go check the chat real quick take a picture of this one check the chat real quick you guys appreciate it appreciate you guys watching we're gonna do one more aisle which is gonna be the hunting aisle and then we're gonna call it um, let me just check the chat real quick and see if anybody's got if you guys got any questions please put them down in the comments I can try to answer them before we get my uh, before we get done for the night uh, where are we at Clara said I have found the Forever Bride one carat uh, silver band normally 240. Nice, good job, Clara. Finding that uh, nice diamond ring 248 marked down to 69. Yeah, I've found a couple rings. They are very hard sells. I found a $398 ring marked down to 99. It took me almost two months to sell it. What state are you in, in Hunter, uh, Clara? I am. Right now, I am in Northern Virginia. Um, I frequent this area often, um, but I'm all over. I go to Maryland, I go to West Virginia, I go to Virginia, I go to um, Pennsylvania. I'm, I'm all over the place. But yeah, um, I, I like to stick in this area. There's a lot of good Walmarts in this area. Homer is getting rid of Bell stuff and going to Schwinn, I heard. Frontier Flipper. Good to know, man. Appreciate it. Yeah, like I said, if you find Bell stuff, scan them away. Uh, Brad bought every Bell tire and inner tube my Wally World had. Only have half of them left. There you go. I mean, great eBay flip. If you didn't do that, go to a flea market. Sell them online. Um, Frontier is asking Brad where he flips them. Uh, local and E. I'm presuming saying eBay. Uh, let's see. Big 292. Umbrellas, backpacks, bandanas, kid watches. Super cheap out by me. Yeah, they're probably getting rid of them and bringing the new stuff in for springtime. Um, it could be anywhere from a package change to a discontinued item. They got to get it out of here. Um, every, shelf uh, every shelf space that they have is thousands of dollars to them in merchandise so they want to get rid of it um i think walmart sold juvie is that because it's returned scan those tires and tubes yes return to damaged item uh anyone else finding the dollar 50 candles i found a couple earlier brad but not at this store but i wanted to show you guys what you should be looking out for uh, check like older scents like from Christmas scents to fall scents a little bit uh, let's see regular clearance tags have a date usually on them and most of the time if the date is older than a week or two it will scan lower yes Frontier Flipper you're on the ball tonight that is correct um, that is definitely correct that's what I was saying earlier. If you're if you're getting a tag that's just a couple days old from when the date that you're looking at it, uh, I would just go by with what it says. Um, but if it's older, older, scan it. 
doesn't hurt to scan it at, at all. Seems like the, uh, Claire says it seems like the East Coast gets their clearance first. So being on the West Coast, I'm kind of getting an idea of what's coming. Yeah, Claire, it, it all works in a big cycle. Um, some stores are before others. Some stores are way behind. Um, once you get into the rhythm of things and know the stores that you go to, you'll kind of figure out um, what clearance is out first, what department goes which day. And you can always talk to the employees. Make friends with the employees. Um, they may even be able to give you their number and you can call, you know, contact them. And they can let you know when good deals pop up. Let's see, Coco, good tip. Thanks, you're welcome. Brad, those rings are tempting though. I know, they're so tempting. And I'm still finding a few out there, but I just, I can't bring myself to do it. Uh, Clara, thank you, it was a gift to me. I'm from Virginia originally, grew up around Richmond area. Yeah, Richmond got hit pretty hard with some ice storms uh, recently. Clara, no candles in my area. Yeah, I mean, between, the candles are a couple couple days old now and if they hit social media guys it's on fire um a lot of people that don't pay for the subscriptions to get um on the deals as soon as possible they use social media for free a lot of social media influencers such as myself like to put things out there i i tend to be a little frugal when i put stuff out but I definitely will help as many people out as I can. I just don't want to put out too much stuff. Um, I'm going to be putting out some memberships soon. And one of the membership perks are going to be first. They're going to be first. Um, first items that I notice that are on my list that I want to provide to the people um, that are in the membership area. So... That'll be coming soon. Let's see if I can find that impact wrench that he was talking about. All we got is hyper tough. And I'm not seeing it. Okay, so right here. You see this? This electric pressure washer is going to be as low as $45. Right now, it's $145. Let's scan it just to, just to double check. Um... But I did see in, in the area that I'm in, I'm not going to travel there because it's late tonight. And all, of course, all the Walmarts close at 11 now. So we can't go too far with it. So yeah, it's 145. But yeah, keep your eye out for those. If they would have hit 45, I probably would have bought them because I could turn around and flip them for 100 bucks. Especially come springtime. That's what I'm talking about, guys. You gotta think of items that are coming out for springtime, like leaf blowers and stuff like that. If you can get those on clearance in the wintertime, hold and you can hold them, hold them until the season is right to sell them. Because top dollar for them. Top dollar for sure. Okay. Brad says $2 Mossy Oak hats out there too. Yep, I saw those. Uh, let's see, Chelsea, how much for membership? Um, membership's going to be through YouTube. It's going to be, I don't know if you've seen it before, but it's got a join button. And I believe there's two different uh, tiers. Uh, I believe one of them is $2.99, which gets you a little bit of items. I think it just gets you noticed more um, from the influencer and influencer themselves when chatting or doing lives and the other tier i believe is 9.99 and i'm able to make videos um, that are strictly for that membership that those members can view um, as i post them uh it's something new to me man this thing's been around here forever look at all the clearance tags on this thing 100 80 80 80 it's been here forever just sell the dang thing. Give it to me for 25 bucks and I'll buy it right now. No, that's not gonna happen, but you can always try, right? So it's still 80 bucks. 
All right, guys, we're getting up on an hour and 20 minutes. Still 33 people in through here, 32 likes. Uh, I'm going to be closing up shop after I go up through the hunting section. Um, smash the like button, subscribe to the channel. Stay up to date with me, guys. Uh, definitely stay up to date. All this stuff's old. Those aisles right here are junk. I don't even go to them. I mean, I'll, I'll take a quick glance, but they're just straight up junk. All right, let's see. Is that honey now? Let's take a quick glance real quick through here. All right. I'll check the chat here in a second. Let me just walk up through here. Ooh, 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 what do we have down here? We have a four piece combo knife set. That's not bad at all. And the tag says, January 19th. Marked down to nine bucks. Let's see if I can scan the barcode. Let's scan the barcode, guys. Come on. Come on, phone. There we go. They are $4. At $4, I'm going to buy every single one of them. But you know what? My brother-in-law will love these. These also make great yard sale uh, stuff. I mean, let's just say these is four dollars for me, okay, guys? And you turn around and you could probably sell it for as much as fifteen bucks at a yard sale or a flea market. Stuff like this will go quick. If you can make ten dollars each on on one of them, good lord! As I drop them, oh, not to break them. You know what? I'm gonna take the display. Cause it's gonna look nice in my yard sale. So I'm gonna take the display and every single of this package right here. I'm not gonna take this one, it's broken. But I'm gonna take every single one of them. Let's see. What do we have here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Let's leave one for someone else. Plus this one's broken. We'll just get an even number eight. Not too shabby. See? All it takes is just a little bit of time and effort, guys, and you can really score eight of these. Four dollars each. If I don't sell them, my brother-in-law will sell them. If he doesn't sell them, okay, another thing. If you don't want it, you get it's I mean it's simple. You can, you can return it. You have 30 days to return anything. If it doesn't sell within 30 days, you don't want it, return it. There's no reason why you can't win. But I just noticed this, uh, this metal detector. 11, 11, 10, 20. Let's see if the price has changed on it. If I can get the thing to scan. Come on, there we go. What do we got, what do we got? And six. All right, so let's put our, uh, I got some weight to it. Let's put our, uh, our knives in the, in the box. Bring those home with us. Nice little, nice little life set. Let's see, let me check the chat real quick. All right, Omar, what does it say? Guys, if it says it's not always true, never know until you go to the store check. Yes, Omar. Um, please, this is for everyone in general. Please do not use the Walmart app as an inventory checker, um, as a quantity count. Do not use it. BrickSeek is way more accurate. BrickSeek is not always 100% accurate, accurate either, but it's definitely going to be more accurate than the Walmart app will ever be. Just use the Walmart app for finding the hidden clearance like I showed you and for scanning um, to know the real-time prices in the store. Okay, uh, let's see. Brad says, Tinks, duh, dough, and rot cheap cheap. Put in fridge till a month before deer season and sell. They are crazy regular price. Um, yeah, I mean, this, this goes back. Um, what Brad is saying is true. Yeah, supply and demand, guys. Chelsea only fans for clearance. 
Uh, let's see, big. Any quick funny stories about how security always follows us around while we scan? <laughs> Attention Walmart customers, the time is now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know you guys close soon. Um, no, I don't have any funny stories. I don't really have too many people following me around. That's why I like to try to source at the end of the day. Um, cause people will, people will be looking at you like this. What are you doing scanning yourself? What are you doing filming yourself? You know, it's just, it just gets crazy sometimes, you know, but what can you do? Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see, Brad, can I help you just start scanning? Yeah, Brad, if you got a better phone than this piece of junk that I'm using tonight, Come on, man. Let's go. Gonna have to look for those knives. We'll sell easy here. I mean, yeah. It all depends on your area. If you're out in the country, and then little things. You could even sell these on eBay. Alright. Let's see. Let's see. Omar's talking to True Big True. Is the same for almost first they would follow me, but now they know me and are polite. So I said, just, just be friendly. Please, don't be rude to them. They may help you out. They may help you find stuff. The employees I'm talking about. Um, did anybody get any of those $5 mag lights? Clara. Clara, I've seen the mag lights as low as $3 and some odd cents. And no, I wasn't able to score any. Um, but if you if you keep an eye out and you find them, let's say that they're at this store that I'm at now, and they're still about $20 or so, keep checking keep checking because they're going to drop and you could be the first one to grab them that's with any items uh cindy what's the brand name on the knives it's ozark trail that's walmart's brand ozark trail uh let's see j-rex those last knives were different than the first ones you scanned are they yes they are so we've got some with with a pen and we got some with a bottle opener and a flashlight good call good call j-rex that's almost a rookie move wow can't believe i let myself down on that one but i would have challenged it and said look this one before at the scanner i would have said look this one scans four dollars all the rest of these are are going to scan four dollars as well because they're all the same i wouldn't show them that they're different but just to be on the safe side, let's double check. You see? $4. So that's cool. Got a little Dura on the back. Nice little 8-pointer. 9-pointer, 10-pointer. That one's nice though. Got a little pin in it. Two knives. Not sure what that... That might be a little money clip or something. But good call on that. Good, good call. Let's see. Where are we at? Clara, not yet, but still looking thumbs up what's the regular price on those knife sets it says 15 I'm still here so it says 15 I believe it's probably like 15 before that so what's that 75% off almost 80 I've been checking uh, let's see I've been checking with Brixie for a couple of years and have not once found anything that they said they have Ooh, Clara that's not good um, I've been on brick for quite some time Please DM me um, On my Instagram page uh, Hunter of the clearance we can chit chat a little bit more and I can try to help you out Brickseek is an amazing tool for your tool belt um, It's to be used with a grain of salt But it's a great thing for your tool belt J Rex with the thumbs up. I got the set and it was ten dollars from Clara Okay, I don't know if she's talking about the same knife set, but could be. Let's keep moving on. We'll finish this up very soon. Nice little kayak. No ammo whatsoever. Uh, let's see. So this this hunting section is no good. Um, I'm just walking back through here. This should have been a lot better. But this is also an area that is not hunting. This is more of a city Walmart. So, I mean, what do you expect? Um, 
But yeah, we we're gonna keep moving and see if we can. We might sneak in through here. Let's just do it really quick. I'll let you guys see. I don't think any of these are on sale. 487. We can scan it really quick. We're at an hour and 30. I told myself I was only gonna go an hour with this. But I just get so caught up in the moment. I just want to keep finding you guys deals. No, 487. 44 people in here. Wow. Awesome, guys. Appreciate each and every one of you for tuning in. Hopefully, I was able to provide value to you. Get you as much visuals as possible. Smash that like button. We're at 35, 36 likes. See if we can get it to 40 before the, uh, before the night's over with. I'm just looking around right here. There was a first aid kit that was $16. I'm not seeing it here. It's an international, international um, kit, international uh, first aid kit. I'm just not seeing it here. Uh, yeah, I'm not seeing it. I'm not seeing much of anything. I've seen hunting backpacks. Regular backpacks, even these um, tumblers. None of these tumblers are on sale. At least they say, they don't say they're on sale. And all the WalMarts that I've been to recently have told me that um, things were on sale. It was literally mocked. I mean, that's the easiest way. I'm just looking for something really quick, guys. Vacuum steel. No, I'm not seeing it. I'm looking for the one tumbler. Okay, guys. I think we might be finished here. Should we walk down this? Oh, flashlights. Yeah, she said flashlights. Let's see if I can find a flashlight. So it's right here, but it's not here. It's right here, but it's not here. I'm going to scan it so you guys can see what it is. So they were $28.88. They're marked down to three bucks. Come on. Let me try to scan it again. Come on. Zoom in. Oh lordy. I cannot leave without getting this scanned. This is really fucking me. I do apologize. Bear with me. There we go. So yeah, you can see. Look, three dollars and forty cents. That's what it looks like. It's a mag light. Um, checking top stock. Probably not gonna be here. If you really wanted to get into it, you could uh, revert to BrickSeek to check inventory status. Um, that also takes longer it's more advanced something that you will learn with time uh, but yeah it, it it would take a lot more time to uh, but let's see what we have here it's been broken this is another one that's on sale they might be getting rid of, rid of mag light altogether 1490 it says it's $17.94, a couple bucks off. But the other stores that I've been to, there's been different stuff marked for flashlights, not here. Tell you what, these city folk, man. These city folk. Got some bats, though. This is old tags. Man, these bats are super old. Literally, I've been on bats like a month ago. I didn't think they were still out here. 3585 some of these would be hot resale items very hot resale items or if you just needed them for your kids or your friends who have kids just try to scan but these these things are just in the way so yeah let's walk down here real quick you guys can uh, tag the uh, baseball stuff, but you guys can't tag the uh, the flashlights. What's going on? Hoping to find uh, a duck blind or a hunting blind like I found 
the other night as well as some deer feeders man this is not the area oh man these are all new basketball hoops too all right guys i think we're gonna call it for tonight i appreciate each and every one of you we got it up to 42 people in here 35 likes let me uh just go through the chat real quick i don't want to leave you guys hanging if you guys have any more questions please um let me know i'm going to answer all these real quick and then we're going to move out okay let's see where we at uh, clara uh yes sir same knife set linda hey hunter thanks for sharing your hints with us you're welcome linda anytime uh, Clara, thank you so much, Hunter, for taking the time to share with us. You're welcome. I like to, I like it when my when my followers can can score. I, I really want to build this community up around all that. Uh, I'm not out here to, you know, clickbait anybody or steer anybody wrong with you know, fake this and fake that. But yeah, I just want you guys to score. Youth BB guns were nine dollars. Nice. You can turn around and flip those. Grabbed a bunch of those today. Brad, man, you are killing it. Uh, Myron, I'm glad you found a hidden clearance. Yeah, Myron, I think you were in here last time. Uh, I could be wrong, though. But yeah, I love hidden clearance. <laughs> this has been nice. I get to view what's out there from the comfort of my chair. Yeah, I, I enjoy these lives. It's, it's definitely my... Uh, second live and i i definitely enjoy it and look time flies by an hour and 36 minutes i feel like i just started um i try to get as many of you guys educated as i can hopefully you guys don't come into my stores and steal what i need to find first but hopefully i can beat you to it you know but yeah yeah conrad thanks drew i learned some things tonight you're welcome appreciate you joining in those tubs of baseballs are on clearance yes yes they are um they weren't marked down too heavily, uh, maybe like 10, 15 bucks off, but they'll sell quickly come springtime when baseball comes around. Rebecca, check the carpets. Yeah, we, we were there earlier. Um, scroll back, try to find it. I didn't get any carpets here, but I definitely scored, let's see, one, two, I scored seven, seven carpets last night. Um, you can check my Instagram. I believe I posted it on there. Uh, it was heavy cart. I could barely push it. Jeez Louise. All right, let's see. Gary, have a safe drive home. Thanks, man. It's a little getting a little icy out there now, but yeah, I got to get out here and make the videos for you guys. I got to do it. Brad, thanks for your time, man. Nice video. Appreciate it. Appreciate it, Brad. Hopefully see you next uh, next week in next video. Hopefully next week um, Walmart will pump out some more good clearance for us and we'll be able to uh, score big. That's what we're here for, right? Uh, wow, I was impressed at five dollars. Uh, Claire says pressed at five dollars for the maglite. Three dollars is even better. I know. When they first hit, um, I was on it. I was hopping around a few stores here, checking my inventory checker. Um, but yeah, it just got out of hand, and I think that day there was another storm that was out, so I was kind of debating whether or not to go out. Uh, Cindy, thanks for heads up on new items to look for. Have a great night. Same to you, Cindy. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, Rebecca, I'm sorry you missed it. Will do. Yeah, check back, Rebecca. Um, you can always check my Instagram page, too. Hunter of the Clearance. I give more detailed pictures. Uh, sometimes I'll throw out UPC photos, but I do try to post UPCs and SKU numbers. Um, you can always ask me, too. I'm there to help you Gary check those LOL sleeping bags behind you oh Gary you're yelling at me man all right I'll check them for you but I don't know if they're gonna be anything but if they are Gary guess what I'm gonna buy one just for you if I can get this stinking phone man it's the phone it's the phone there we go there we go what do we got 1488 Gary looks like you're sleeping in the lol sleeping bag tonight buddy 1488 all right guys I appreciate each and every one of you for tuning in tonight uh, 
hope you guys got some value out of tonight's video um we definitely found some good finds tonight can't wait for the day we can take this mask off um what are they saying 7 a.m we can come back at 7 a.m nice no nah, we're, we're not coming back at seven i might hit some more stores up tomorrow it's the weekend what are you gonna do right got to get out there and make some money thanks again for watching guys i appreciate each and every one of you for, uh tuning in smash that like button on your way out bring it up to 40 and i'll see you guys next week and we'll find some more great finds for clearance hunting at walmart peace guys take care